There are many ways of approaching creating percussion sounds with a subtractive synthesizer. One common one is to use noise as our sound source. So what we can do is we can, on the ES1, use our sub-oscillator's noise generator to create the sound. Now, percussion sounds always die away, so we can create a delay or decay envelope. And that gives us a basic noise percussion sound. We could try and turn it into something like a hi-hat by filtering it a bit. Let's uh, take the resonance up, change the filter shape, tune it. So there we have something which could act as a hi-hat. We can make it quicker. We can get different variations by uh, changing the decay time and the attack time. Now it sounds kind of like a hi-hat being operated by the foot. We can do other variations like this. Tune it around. So, sounding a little bit like a tambourine. So we've got different variations like that. We could also try and turn it into something like a snare drum sound. You'll notice at the moment we're not filter or changing the filter at all. Let's do this. Take the cutoff frequency down, get rid of our resonance, sweep the filter. So down a bit. Then we can start to get things which we can act kind of like snare drum sounds or electronic clap sounds. We can we can add a little bit of resonance down here. We can add some overdrive. Make it a bit fuller. And of course we could add compression and equalization to enhance it. So that's a couple of sounds that you can get just using noise here from the sub-oscillator with the appropriate envelope and tuning the filter.